how do you start on a project like this? Like, I think a thing that I see a lot of AI developers and people building stuff with these tools do wrong is they try to do the like 100% version of the thing all at once. To me, it seems yeah. like the struggle right now is how do we sort of sequence this thing that eventually gets us to the place that we think and hope this technology is going, but that actually works today. Have you figured out how to sort of sequence your way to this magical thing that may someday be true, but clearly isn't yet? Yeah, I think that's the tricky part, right? Like we all seen the shiny demos on in launch videos, and then they fall apart the moment you use it, right? And it's kind of annoying. And I mean, sometimes those things don't even ship, like they're just videos, and they're never get a, getting material. It's science fiction, right? right? And it is like the, the dream. This is the interesting thing about this moment is like, I think people yeah. mostly agree on what the dream is. But yeah. it is still a dream, right? Like yeah. it is, it is, it's, it's a plausible future, but it is still the future. I, I wonder, like, if it ends up being this, like, you know, like self-driving cars. Like, oh, it's just like one more year, and then it's going to be self-driving, right? And then it, this goes on yeah. for ten years, right? I, the progress that LLMs made shows a bit different the trend, right? The trend is more like, oh wow, we're like having like a lot of progress in a very short time and it doesn't seem to, sh to stop anywhere close but i think like it boils down to like sort of the usual things like do the simple things first right so try out because it's such a new technology you kind of need to get an understanding what's possible and what is not and so it's a lot of like just prototyping and see kind of what sticks and what brings real value and it's not just like science fiction as you say which maybe works one out of uh, 10 times and then that's not going to be useful right. right and so i think like finding that middle ground is extremely hard 